Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Alpha Protocol. I'm Burning Dogface, and I'm about to upgrade my armor. And look, having I had my eye on this one for quite a while now. Further improving upon the tactical utility. Ah, sorry, can't do the voice and uh, read at the same time. Apparently, further improving upon the tactical utility armor design. This custom tailored suit provides additional pockets, bandoliers, and room for personal customization. While offering exceptional protection, modularity, and storage, this bulky armor system makes a lot of noise in the wearer when the wearer is moves. Yoink! Oh, I haven't equipped that yet. Uh... Poof! Do I even have... Yes, I do! I forgot to sell these. That's right. Decisions, decisions. Punching, or, uh... I don't know what the word for that would be, actually. Technical espionage, let's just say. Whatever, I'm good enough at uh, those things. Now then, let's sell the old armor and see what kind of intel we can get. Man, cleared me out. Goodbye, old friend. I don't need this one anymore. Oh dear. Uh, let's see. Dossier info on G22, mission map, sniper rifle dead drop, and more dossier information. Okay. Let's do that. Yes, 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 yes. Now let's read up on G22 and Sergei Zerkov. Then we'll get this show on the road. G-22 field agents are is this, yeah, are trained for infiltration and sabotage. Open warfare is not their way. The average G-22 operative is not a trained soldier. Most G-22 agents come from espionage backgrounds. Strong resolve and keen senses are the selection criteria for combat agents in G-22. Physical strength and stamina are often a secondary concern. Expect an enemy that is hard to evade, but unlikely to withstand sustained aggression. Survivors of G-22 assaults report that electrical stun grenades are part of the organization's arsenal. Um... Hmm. Only vaguely I remember him. Surkov has had a long career, including working with the KGB, rumored ties to the Russian Mafia, and now perhaps the most dangerous role of all, an entrepreneur. He's embraced the new capitalist Russia with a quiet intensity, using his long years in government and possibly under world circles to network beyond Russia's borders and seize opportunities as they appear. That being said... Let's rock. How did he get there? I'm just gonna waltz into the American Embassy in Russia with a, sh with a uh, sniper rifle. Makes even less sense. Oh. Turn up anything, Nina? The name Grigory provided. Sergei Surkov. He's well connected in Moscow, and he may know what Halbeck's plans are. Any idea where I can find him? I've confirmed he's at the American Embassy now. He should be there for the next few hours, if his schedule holds. Good to hear. Is something wrong? Something's interfering with the signal. I'm going to switch to another frequency. What the hell? Mike. Shock! I you're going after Surkov. I suppose it's too much to ask to give me some warning before you interrupt my calls. We don't have a lot of time. I know about your mission, and I can assist you in getting to Zirkov. When you arrive at the embassy, I can patch your frequency and provide support as your handler. I think you'll find G-22's resources are considerable. What? What? I've already got the help I need, Albatross. Thanks. Mike, 
G-22 is the only one you can count on in Moscow. Not exactly. I know someone who will be happy to help. Who are you? What happened? I got cut off. Mina, I think Z's gonna be joining us at the embassy. What? No time to explain. But I think we need to reach Surkov now. Well, I didn't want him as my handler, but I didn't want... certainly don't want Z. What the hell is going on? Do I have to load again? Guess so this is the embassy, huh? I was hoping for something a little cheerier. Mike, I'm receiving the link request from VCI. Are you sure you want... Shh, little girl. Oh, God. Time for the big boys to play now, yeah? Z, well, that explains the overabundance of testosterone. On oh, the... shit. Michael needs someone who can help him, little girl. You, not so much. Michael, darling, can you hear me? I'm reading you, Z. Are your men in position? It is only you, Michael. We are all alone. Just the two of us. It's a winter night. I'm still here, actually. For now, perhaps. All right. Oh, hell no. Let's see what we got at the front door. Embassy is guarded by a squad of soldiers. Not the best of the United States, but they will put up a small fight, I think. They don't look like they're on alert. It's your call on how to approach them, Mike. All right, I'm on it. No, 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 no. I had to choose between those two. I'm going for the guy I know for a fact isn't crazy. I like Albatross. We have a good working history. Z, I'm not convinced, isn't going to try to murder me. They should have warned me that I would have had a different handler in this one. Turn up anything, Mina? The name Grigori provided. Sergei Surkov. Okay, He's well connected in Moscow, and he may know what Halbeck's plans are. Any idea where I can find him? I've confirmed he's at the American Embassy now. He should be there for the next few hours, if his schedule holds. Good to hear. Is something wrong? Something's interfering. You'd think with he'd recognize signal. that by they now. It has happened like what the four hell? or five times. Mike, I understand you're going after Surkov. I suppose it's too much to ask to give me some warning before you interrupt my calls. We don't have a lot of time. I know about your mission, and I can assist you in getting to Surkov. When you arrive at the embassy, I can patch into your frequency and provide support as your handler. I think you'll find G-22's resources are considerable. I approve. All right. I can use all the help I can get. Excellent. I have your frequency. I'll contact you when you reach the embassy, and we can go from there. I'll get my gear and head out. All right. One last thing, Mike. I prefer infiltrating the embassy quietly. If things should get difficult, however... I'll be ready. Expecting trouble? Always. Great. What happened? I got cut off. Mina, I think Albatross is going to be joining us at the embassy. <laughs> what? No time to explain. <laughs> but I think we need to reach Surkov now. Oh, so we're working against both of our handlers in this case. Great! I thought to save there. Looking so this swanky. is the embassy, huh? I was hoping for something a little cheerier. There's still no contact from G22. Do you want to call them? This is Albatross. Our surveillance indicates you're at the embassy perimeter. Can you confirm? I'm guessing that feedback means you've cut me off from my handler. I've locked down your signal to keep radio traffic to a Oops. minimum. It's a low probability embassy security will pick up our conversation, but I'm worried about other interests. So how do you want to do this? Are we going to be on the buddy system? Wear matching t-shirts? Our goal is to reach Surkov, extract the information, and then go our separate ways. Don't mistake my intentions, Mike. If I had agents in place, I would use them. All right, let's see what we got at the front door. Embassy guards. Attention. Standard issue weapons. According to our intelligence, the embassy hasn't been alerted. So they shouldn't be expecting trouble. Still, approach with caution. Always. Is 
would be so much easier if I were Batman. Okay, good. Replaced the, uh, listen the uh, noise thing, which I've never bothered using, with, uh, health kit. Just in case, once again, it only lets me take three gadgets. I guess that's a perk or an upgrade or something. Fuck, is this gonna work? Oh, that's out. Good. The ladder should grant you roof access. I'd feel more James Bondy if you weren't all hunched over ridiculously. I did not set off that alarm. That was not my fault. Oh. I'd like more info on Z. Lots of reading. Z regularly works at the Egyptian Arms Consortium, the Russian Mafia, Burmese Drug Lords, the North Korean Government, and the Veteran Combat Initiative. It indicates she's currently under contract with the DCI for an undisclosed operation in Moscow. <gasps> no shit! Oh, fuck. Ah. Uh. Damn it, Z. Well, that's annoying. So there's another computer where I can just... Turn off the cameras? Actually, you know what? Oh, it does turn. Holy. I'm not sure what I'm looking at. Hey, maybe he was narcoleptic. Should never jump to a conclusion. Wah! I was wondering if we were going to be seeing Matryoshka. You know, this being a uh, video game and there, this being Russia. Let's take the elevator in the busted ass building. Reinforcements are being deployed. They're repelling from the chopper onto the ledge outside the building. So how are the kids? That wasn't good. Sorry, dude, I'm no rent a cop. I 
And these are Marburg's dudes. Why am I sparing them? Oh, Jesus. Because it's easy, that's why. You guys are a bad joke. Whoa! What in the hell? Ah, oh, great, there's a robot. Oh, Jesus, another robot! And their AI is too stupid to come out here and get me. Which one's this? Useless. Really? mercenaries. You don't have the same in Syria. Oh, it's that guy. If you are one of the attackers, whatever you're being paid, I can pay more. Turn or you can... Feet. I want to hear his voice clearly. Good. You've got his attention. Now get his cooperation. So you're Surkov. Why do you think I've come to kill you? Well, the explosions, gunfire, and the arsenal on your back did not suggest you came here to talk business. Actually, I would like to talk shop, but my first priority is to get you to safety. That actually seems genuine. I do not know these attackers, but I do know this embassy. The embassy security systems are our problem. The explosion has triggered the automatic security gates. They must be disabled if we want to escape the building. So I need to find the security terminal and then override the codes. Yes, the terminal is upstairs. But in the monitoring room next to us, there is a maintenance ladder. Take the ladder to the main security room upstairs. Unlock the gates. Then I can meet up with you at the court. We don't have much time. The room Surkov mentioned should be close by. Once inside, look for a maintenance ladder leading up to the fourth floor. Wow. That's easily the uh, least dif distance I ever had to go for one of those. Oh, they had info on Grigori. So we're just robbing your uh, place of business and your dead co-workers. Pay no mind. Wrong button. These last two. After being captured and held by the Russian mob in 2003, Grigori lost heart in the information trade. He was tortured while in the hands of the mobsters, and it has weakened his resolve to hold on to secrets under pressure. While still an information broker, uh, he claims he has retired from the criminal underworld scene, citing his health as a concern. He has confessed on numerous occasions he'd risk going to the authorities, if hurt again, and tell them all he knows about the underworld. Grigori has made few friends in Moscow, but the ones he has made have been steadfastly loyal to the old man. They have remarked while Grigori is hard to bring out of his defensive shell. Once pressed with enough fr friendliness and good-natured genuine interest, the old man is loyal to a fault. Repeated gestures of goodwill, the ability to warm the man's heart, and introduce his new friend to others and businesses in Moscow. Where am I going? Oh, that's right. Wow, 
Wait, I can just open the door. Oh, come on. It's right here, too. No health, though. Whoa! Let me see if I can open the maintenance hatch by remote. You do that. Ah! <sighs> They've deployed several groups on the roof. Be careful. You know what? I need him to come closer. No, I don't want it back. Perfect. Good night. There's got to be a first aid kit around here somewhere. This is madness. The VCI are getting ahead of you, and it looks like they're hacking the embassy systems. Piss. Bravo squad, moving out. Did it. Security gate's unlocked. Now all I have to do is get out of here. Rendezvous with Sirkov in the main courtyard. He should be on his way there now. Ah, good. Checkpoint. Because we are really going over time now. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you on the next episode of Let's Play Alpha Protocol. Later. <laughs>